Thank you for joining Fallsbrook Center and The Natural Bee for our cold frame tutorial. Cold frames historically were attached to greenhouses. The unheated, transparent top structures protect plants from poor weather. Our double hooped version will increase our plant hardiness zones by three zones. The structure will also protect plants from snow, frost, and some pests. The structure is eight feet by 42 inches using two by sixes for the base and two by fours for the top structure. You may use a larger base piece and that would give you a greater depth for your plants. Two hinges are attached to the back joining the top and bottom frames. Measure halfway down the eight foot lengths. Use a hand drill with a wood spade bit to make a hole. Drill down between three quarters of an inch to one inch in depth a half an inch from the edge. Continue for all four corners. The formula for measuring the hoops is two times pi times r. To create space between the inner and outer hoops, remove two inches from the measurement for the inner hoop. Once you've measured your piping, cut using plastic tubing cutters. Extra support while bending your piping is helpful. Watch for the bounce back. Once your pipes are set, drill and secure the pipes using a three inch screw. support pieces the length of the entire base. Drill with one inch screws to secure. Secure the rest of the joints with vinyl electrical tape. That also protects the plastic. Cut three supports the length of the unit. Drill with one inch screws to attach. Secure the joints with vinyl electrical tape to secure and to protect the plastic. Using clear greenhouse plastic with UV coating, cut the sheet in half. One half will be used for each layer. Cut thin boards to secure the plastic sheeting.
using one inch screws closely placed. Once the back is secure, pull the front plastic so it is taut before attaching the board. At each end, secure the center and twist the sheeting tightly to the center. Use boards to secure the plastic using the one inch screws. Trim the plastic once you are finished. For the second hoop structure, use the wood drill spade bit an inch from the center structure. Drill through securing board and into the base of the 2x4s. Repeat the process of securing the PVC with screws and taping the top joints. You will not be able to drill through the center top hoop for the side PVC supports. Skip that step. All other steps are identical. Thank you for joining Fallsbrook Center in the Natural Bee. Come back to our YouTube channel for more tutorials.